Hello everyone, this is Chris with CricketUsers.com and the US Tech Channel. Uh, before I sold my Samsung Admire 2 on eBay, link below in the description, I wanted to show you guys the use of Samsung uh, Tech Tiles. Uh, these are NFC uh, tiles that will allow you to accomplish a variety of tasks really quickly if you have NFC enabled on your uh, Samsung uh, device. The uh, device also has to be capable, I think, think uh, there might be more to it however I know for a fact the Galaxy S4 and the Samsung Admire 2 will work with this one of the things you want to do is go ahead and enable uh, NFC it would be in settings more settings then NFC you could also enable S beam uh, if you want to communicate uh, quickly with some other devices send files back and forth um, use Wi-Fi Direct, etc. So let's go back out. Once you purchase the tech tiles, which retail for $14.99, the actual original ones, the authentic uh, Samsung ones, uh, you'll want to go into the Play Store and locate the tech tiles program called Samsung Tech Tiles. Go ahead and install that. I've already programmed this with the LG Optimus G Pro. I'm going to reprogram it with the Samsung so it will understand and be able to communicate with it. This is what you get. You get five of them for the $14.99. Little booklet that gives you some starter uh, instructions, some basic pointers. And it'll come in a strip like this. As you can see, I've already mounted one of them to the corner of the table. Let's go ahead and open this application. Gives you a little introduction. So, this tag has already been programmed. I guess we could just reset the tag. Let's hold the device close to it. Tag has been reset successfully. So most of the time people will use common tasks uh, like putting the device in home mode, configuring Wi-Fi, uh, cellular data use, and things like that. Uh, you can create even more uh, complex tasks continue to add so like I said the most common will probably be settings um, let's say at home you want the Wi-Fi to turn on or you can on off or you can just have it toggle uh, back and forth if you want it to change its state um, from on to off or off to on every time you touch it let's actually change this to on Bluetooth at home, I only use it in the car. Automatic brightness, I'll say we'll go on at home. Or actually, say brightness will go to 100%. Screen at home will time out at 10 minutes so I can do my videos. Driving mode will be off. get to turn the flash on you can choose applications to start this basically has all my applications not just Samsung applications social networks update your Facebook status well there's a few things that you can do like I said most people will just use this to toggle uh, settings on the device. Let's go ahead and write this to the tag. 
tag has been successfully written. Alright, so let's turn the brightness really far down there. Auto brightness is off and Wi-Fi is off. So when I touch this tag, it should turn that on. So it said right there, test has been run. Wi-Fi was turned back on. Let's go back in and configure the brightness again and fix that up. We'll say automatic brightness at 100%. Go ahead and rewrite this to the tag. Tag has been written successfully. Let's go ahead and turn Wi Fi off and turn brightness all the way down again. Brightness on, Wi-Fi on. So it does work. You have five of these tags, so you can put one at your home desk, uh, by your uh, bed, at your office, uh, in your car. Uh, possibilities are really endless, but if you're interested in something like that, uh, be sure to check it out. I'll put links to the Samsung store where you can get the genuine one in the description below. Please like these videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel as viewers like you that allow me to do videos like this. And remember, this phone is on sale. Again, check the description below and you'll see the link to our eBay uh, auction. It ends on Wednesday the 28th. All right, thanks a lot. Actually, Thursday the 29th, sorry. Have a good one.